what's going on subscribers welcome back to another brand new video from the flaming profits youtube channel in today's video i'm going to show you exactly where to invest your 401k roth ira investments this will guarantee you the best return on investment and will guarantee you becoming a millionaire in your lifetime all right we're gonna be talking about that today stay in tune Welcome to the Flaming Profits YouTube channel. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. That way you do not miss out any brand new videos from us where we teach you how to become a more profitable investor in the stock market. All of our videos are aimed to improve your financial life, which pretty much improves all of your life overall. So make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit the like button on this video before we get started. Leave me a comment down below in the comment section once you get done watching. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Really quick before we get started, I do want to share some of our amazing affiliate links that you can use to get free money to invest with, with especially free stocks. So with M1 Finance, you get $10 to start investing with them. For Robinhood, you get a completely free stock as long as you sign up with the link that I have in the description. A lot of great deals. And we also have $5 from Acorns. This is a really cool app that I actually use to invest all of my cash back that I get from credit cards. This makes me get an additional percentage cash back just by investing that money. I have a video on this if you're interested. And then for Webull, they actually give you two completely free stocks. A very good deal I got about $15 from the free stocks because I sold them so that's $15 I didn't have and then this secure credit card allowed me to be able to actually apply and get an actual credit card I struggled a lot getting approved for an actual credit card so this allowed me to do so and you get $50 of free spending money as long as you sign up using the link that I have in the description all right so without further ado let's go ahead and get started all right, so the reason why you want to be investing with a retirement account to begin with is because a brokerage account is an account that, that does not offer any tax benefits. So if you sell any investments from your account, you're probably gonna face capital gains taxes, which can be very high and reduce your overall profits and ROI. While a IRA is an individual retirement account and IRAs are tax deferred accounts, that allow your earnings to grow without taxes over time. So this is like a 401k or Roth IRA. And this is why it's important for you to choose to invest with retirement accounts alongside with your brokerage accounts. So this is just to go a little bit more in depth, but you basically understand what I'm saying is a brokerage is nice to make some money on the side, but you're actually gonna make way more money with a retirement account because it has a lot of tax benefits, meaning you're not gonna get charged as much taxes as a brokerage. So I still use both, but that's why you see a lot of people become rich with their retirement accounts and actually be able to retire. You never really hear about someone, someone having a $1 million brokerage account, but you do often hear about that for retirement accounts. And there's a reason for that. So if you want to build long-term wealth, you have to consider opening up a tax deferred account so a retirement account this can be a 401k Roth IRA there's a lot of options out there but just do your research to find the best one to suit your lifestyle it's all gonna depend on you and what you basically need so here are the other reasons why you need a retirement account um, the average life expectancy continues to rise every single year we're, be we're getting better at creating better medicines, newer technologies that improve our life expectancy. So this will continue to rise, therefore you need to create a bigger emphasis on your retirement accounts so that way you can be sustained financially. Second reason is you can't work forever. You can't expect to always be having a consistent steady income. You have to think ahead because one day you might not be able to work. The third reason is retirement is the best time to check off your bucket list. So being in retirement gives you a lot of personal freedom so you'll be able to do things that you might have not been able to do as a working adult 
So it's one of the best places to take advantage of being financially free. You don't want to be settled down uh, by having to work during your retirement years. Instead, you can just be focusing on what you actually want to accomplish in life and actually pursue what it is that you're truly passionate about. Number four, your future may have more financial obstacles than your past or present. You never really know if you're gonna be facing a lot of obstacles, but it's better to be sure. That's why it's important for you to focus on that. Number five, relying on social security for a pension is risky. This is what the government tells us that they have for us, but you shouldn't rely on that. You should have backup plans. You should never rely on one specific entity or person at all. Uh, you wanna be extra careful to, to uh, assume that that's gonna be there whenever you retire. Number seven, it's unfair to depend upon your family. Why are you gonna put financial stress and burden on your family? You should be independent and taking care of yourself, thinking of he ahead. A lot of people can't get ahead in life because they have someone that they have to um, like basically take care of financially. So they're never able to get ahead themselves. And that's just gonna limit others. You don't want others to, other people to have to take care of you financially. Number nine, Retirement planning is important for you to start today for a lot of reasons, but let's go ahead and talk about the best place to get the highest return you can on retirement accounts. This can be a 401k or Roth IRA. So Fidelity, a broker that a lot of 401ks have or use, and a place where you can start your own Roth IRAs or individual retirement accounts, offers these types of funds so that are zero fee meaning you do not pay any expenses whatsoever usually every sort of index fund has some sort of fee that they charge even if it's 0 0.04 0 0.5 0 0.2 whatever it is however these four following funds charge absolutely nothing so no nothing that you have to pay no fees nothing whatsoever they're called zero funds by fidelity and all these four funds are very very good and diversified because for example, the first one is the Fidelity Zero Large Cap Index Fund. This allows you to invest in those companies that are in the considered large cap in the United States. So these are companies that have a very high market cap, such as Microsoft, Apple, Facebook, Google. All of these companies belong to this index. And by you investing in this one, you're getting a piece of all of those combined. So you don't have to worry about stock picking you're getting a very diversified fund just by investing in this one. And there is no fees at all, so you'll be able to grow um, tax-free and also fee-free. Um, I don't know if you read uh, Tony Robbins' Master of the Game. It talks a lot about how fees are a big problem with retirement accounts and creating wealth. Um, a lot of people don't realize how significant a 0.05% fee is over time. So this is something to pay attention to and research yourself. The second fund that we have here is the Fidelity Zero Extended Market Index Fund. So this allows you to get some mid cap and small cap stocks all in this fund without you having to handpick any of them. So it's a very good way to be diversified and get large cap and small and mid cap at the same time by investing in both of these funds. And then the total market index fund is probably my personal favorite because you're able to enjoy the domestic market profits as well as the international market and these are both gonna be growing industries, I mean sectors. Usually um, domestic grows more than international, but international does have some advantages when domestic is weak. And then the fourth fund that we have here is the Fidelity Zero International Index Fund. So this focuses more on international funds that we have, so foreign companies that still grow in revenue and create profits every single year. So you'll be able to take advantage of international companies, not just domestic, by investing in this fund. So this is what I've been doing and I highly recommend you to try it out because this is the only way pretty much to get a retirement account um, being tax deferred and also taking advantage of zero funds, I mean zero fee funds. So basically best of both worlds. Um, you can never go wrong by doing this and I have no doubt that you'll be able to retire with millions of dollars if you simply stick to a disciplined strategy where you invest a certain dollar amount into your retirement account and then invest into the serial fee funds that Fidelity offers for you. 
and this is exactly what I'm doing to create wealth. Um, I hope that this message brought value to you and that you do research on this. I'm not recommending you to do anything. I'm not a financial advisor. So as always, do your own research. My profits are, your, are not your profits. Um, your losses are not my losses. So always do your own due diligence when researching investments and picking your own investments. There we go, subscribers. That's how you can ensure that you get the highest return on investment for your retirement accounts or 401k. This is exactly what I'm doing. I hope that this video brought value to you. Like I said, let me know if you have any questions down below. If you haven't started on your retirement accounts, what questions do you have for me? Let me know in the comment section down below. Make sure you like this video. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.